What I see is that you're separating yourself from English and from your practice. This is my life and this is my English, which I hate, but I'm going to do it. This is my vocabulary. This is my grammar. This is my self-correction. This is my listening. And this is me. The real change will happen when you start integrating them. What do I mean? You think pronunciation is a separate entity that exists somewhere in a separate world. But what skill are you developing? It's the same skill that you develop when you do the self-correction practice. You're becoming more attentive to self. You see this as an additional thing that you have to learn or master, which is separate from you. But your pronunciation can never be separate from you. Even if you're not focused on changing your pronunciation, your ability to notice the gap or to become more attentive to how you say things, you're just becoming more attentive to self. When you see some things about yourself, you can't unsee them. So you, you, you want to take action because you can't unsee them. It's not about pronunciation. It's not about the fact that your accent is bad. You don't want to pay attention to how you're actually doing things. That's why you keep doing them the same way. Even if you don't want to change your pronunciation, even if it's not your focus, you will not be able to not pay attention to it when you really, really see it.